My wife's put me on a diet. <laughs> Homemade parachute. We know it'll work because it's orange. Adventures of Seven! The day's adventure begins with an orange rope. And what are we going to do with this orange rope? You're going to have to wait and see. So make sure you subscribe because when these two get together, they always do something amazing, right? Yep. yep. Ezra and da -da 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 -da. Who are you? Oh, Kimber. <laughs> Kimber! Phase two, an orange blanket. Have you guessed what they're up to yet? I don't know. I don't ever know what those guys are doing. But I have a mess down here, right here with all my books. Uh, not all my books, about half my books. I gotta go through these because we have an offer on our house and we're probably closing on our house in a few weeks, like um, six weeks or something like that. So um, I gotta pack up the books I wanna keep and get rid of the ones that I wanna keep but I'm not gonna keep since we are downsizing, getting rid of everything and just really trying to keep memory things not stuff we can replace. I figured it out. The world's largest origami cup. Right? Nope. 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 You're cutting a hole in it? Yeah. Yeah. Definitely not a cup. No. I sure hope your life doesn't depend on these knots, Kimber. <laughs> Ezra, you're a boy scout. Are you having better oh, luck? No, look. It is Mom. That's a beautiful granny knot. You have not better luck. Look at okay. it. It's a square knot. Uh, I I'm doing um a slip knot, so I can just slip it off like that. Oh. Okay. Wow. It's a superb granny knot. It is not a granny knot. It's a square All knot. Right. Macy just got home. I've been worried about her. She's like a half hour late. No, I'm not a half hour late. That's an exaggeration. No, you're a half hour late. Why was it the most frustrating drive of your life? Because first I wasn't like paying attention so I got in the wrong lane so I knew how to get home but I hadn't gone that way in a long time so I got in the wrong lane again so I had two detours and then I stopped first at literally every single light turned red right before me. So what's normally like a 10 minute drive became a half hour drive. But you made it. Did you yeah. crash the car? No. Wow, two days driving, no wrecks. Good job. <laughs> My frugal tip for the day, cheap tip for the day, if you are moving or packing stuff or whatever and you need free boxes, go to the liquor store. That is where we got these babies for free. They're nice, sturdy boxes. They're good for heavy things that you don't want in big boxes. So, and they're free and they have a lot of them. And we don't drink alcohol, but I am grateful for the free boxes. The books that I'm keeping are um, special memory for me, like this one, which is the first book Macy learned how to read. So books like that, and then like vintage books that are really hard to find, like this old lady that swallowed a fly that has the cutouts in it. And so those are the ones I'm keeping. And ones, most of the books I buy are from thrift stores, so they only cost a few cents, 25 cents or so. So books, they're kind of like your friends, and they're they're hard to get rid of when you've read them and you wanna you wanna share them and reread them. And so I'm having a harder time than I thought. So what's wrong? He got drenched. You got drenched? Were you playing with water balloons? That's what happens when you play with water balloons, bud. <laughs> Come on, buddy. You got a little bit wet with a water balloon? Just change your shirt, okay? You want to wear a wet shirt all day? Cruiser was playing with water balloons on the trampoline with Brecken and Kimber and got wet and he's a little bit upset about it. <laughs> Smiling because mom makes everything better. That's right. It looks like Brecken got it worse than Cruiser. Who got you? Cruiser got me and then one popped in my face and one popped, popped in your face. No, one popped like down here. Yeah, don't just, you guys know it's only like 28 degrees outside? And my toes are cold. Uh, that would explain it. Maybe Wonder Woman could get you dry. What? Yep. 
We are having some crazy, insane weather going on. A freak snowstorm. It was sunny and nice, and in about two minutes, it went from that to this. What are you doing, crazy? Jumping on the trampoline in the snow. I'm jumping with bare feet. Someone's excited about it. That was cold. What? The only thing cold is my feet. Your feet? They're bare feet. Were you out there on your bare feet? Yes. I'm Ezra, are you ready? Yep. Is it gonna work? Yes. Yes? Okay, authentic, authentic homemade parachute. We know it'll work because it's orange, right? Yeah. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna go down and film you going from down, okay? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh that's not good. Ready? Mm -hmm. To infinity and beyond. <laughs> uh, little problem, your chute didn't even open. Oh. <laughs> uh, you need I to probably jump. hit the beanbag before I, before it got the Yeah, chance. you need some more, some more distance. <laughs> well, I guess that failed. <laughs> Are you ready to go from an airplane now? Yeah. Yeah, okay. I've had experience now. Yeah. So <laughs> I would know <laughs> if I'm ready or not. Second attempt. Make sure it's not twisted. I can't tell. Um, yeah. Are you ready? Okay, here we go. We all know what happens off this balcony. The boot! That's what happens. <laughs> yeah, no broken ankles. At least you're landing on the camera to try and throw uh, I don't know if I should you. jump off here. Could you catch on that? No, uh, no, Dad. No, you're not getting up there. No. Okay. This is why we break ankles at our house. Okay. Ready? You'll be fine. It won't hook on that. Yeah. One, two, three. We need more distance. <laughs> okay. Here I come. No. <laughs> Just kidding. Kimber, we have a little bit of a mess going on. You and Daisy. We are making cupcakes. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's inside of that cupcake? You just had a hole in there. What's in there? Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> Stomp of my broken foot. They have been decorating foot. cupcakes. You're right. It's not my broken foot. Look at all these cupcakes they've been making. That one looks really good. Can I see that one? What the heck is this one? Fish swimming in the sea. Swimming goldfish? Mm hmm. Mm, do you want yeah. one? You don't want the goldfish one? Jed wants it, right, Jed? Can I have that one? Yeah, you do. You look like a goldfish monkey eater. You can take the goldfish. Which one is your favorite cruiser? Mm. Daisy made that one. That's our favorite. Well, they all look delicious, but I won't be what? eating any of them. My wife's put me on a diet. All right, Ezra tells me he can do a front flip off the balcony onto the trampoline, and I don't believe him. Yeah, Okay, let's see it. Ready? On Hold the on. Yeah, on the beam. Okay, go for it. Oh, man, you're crazy. I gotta tell you, I love that kid. He's awesome. Okay, ready? Yep. Nice job, dude. That's sweet. Good job. Okay, Ezra now says he can do a belly flop off of here. Oh, I was gonna show you how far to jump. Oh, okay. Well, whatever. I could do a Whatever's flop coolest. Onto it that far. Oh, okay. Ready? Uh huh. Woo! Nice. That's awesome, buddy. Okay. All right, here goes the belly flop. Oh, you all right? Yeah. Crazy. He's a crazy guy. Okay, if you liked our video and the failure parachuting, then make sure you subscribe.